to make sure everyone can hear. Yes. All right. We can all hear. Hey, cool. All right. Sick. My man, tell us what happened with Christopher Gonzalez and the and the anime crew. Okay. So I. So first there was a some top eight match. No four top eight. For uh, it was like this guy Axis the Beast. Who uses There's Chris G. Con- yeah, he uses, uses Kanji. Yeah, so Kanji and Chris G uses Liz. Liz. Yes. That match is like <laughs> terrible. It was like his worst match. It's like seven three for Elizabeth. That's it's what like I said. Seven three. So, um, I was in the room at that time, but apparently everyone was getting hyped because Axis won. That's like a terrible, terrible matchup. Like yeah. if I lost to Chris G, I'm sure people would get hyped because that's also a seven three matchup. Like me too. So I'm sure people would get hyped if I lost that, right? So he. I don't know what happens. He leaves, and someone shows me a tweet um, that he posts, which says like, "Oh, now I see why everyone hates Persona or whatever, or why people don't play anime games or whatever." And I send him one saying, "Stay free. Like, how how are you going to get mad at people getting hype and like talking shit to you? Like, you're not only are you like a famous player, you play Marvel too as like your main focus, like a main game. Which is why are you mad? Yeah." Which is pretty much uh, shit talk and buttons. Yeah. So wh- why are you yeah. mad? Um, I leave the persona room for a little bit, and he's in. Uh, he's in nearby. He's near me, behind me or something. And uh, he's like, "There he is." And I was like, "Oh, I turn around. Oh, there he is on the computer on Twitter." <laughs> so I talk. I talked to him face to face for like uh, around 30 minutes, and his problem he kept talking about the commentators. The commentators were being really biased and stuff. So I told him, "Hey, um, if you have a problem with the commentators, you should go talk to the commentators or talk to Stickbug. They are over there in that room right there that we can look at from here. You can see Stickbug standing on a chair from where we were. Go talk to them. It's very easy to fix whatever problem you have." But he pretty much kept ignoring me talking really loud, talking about the community, the community, the community over and over. Um, and he was like, well, you're talking shit to me too. And I'm like, of course, this is me, but I am not your problem, right? Your problem is with these commentators. So you should go talk to them. And he just wouldn't do it. Him and his girlfriend were just going off on me for about 30 minutes, talking really loud over me and not really <laughs> listening really to what I had to say. Me. Yeah. So uh, a couple of people, other people were around. I think, um, what's his name? Aquasilk, he was there. Uh, Nerd Josh was also in the vicinity, and they were just kind of bystanders, I guess. Eventually, I just gave up, and I said, I still have a tournament to focus on. If you want to deal with this, you can just go over there. You can still see the two people who are doing the commentary and stick bug from exactly where you're sitting. You can just go there, less than 100 feet, to go talk to them. And I guess he just didn't do it. I saw some people on Twitter, too, like, going really hard on him. I just was like, everyone should just drop this. This guy's... I don't know, just a baby, I guess. Now, so, but the, pretty much the whole, because, all right, if it was me, like, and I even said this because I was actually, uh, SDK was there. I thought, were SDK. you there? Uh, SKD, my bad. <laughs> SKD. SKD was there, and there were, like, a couple of other, like, known, you know, like, anime dudes, Persona players, whatever players. They were mm-hmm. all standing over there. I'm not sure if you were there yet. And I was talking to them because they were like, yo, Joe, you hear what happened? I'm like, nah, dude, what happened? And they're like, yeah, Chris Jean, blah, 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 blah. And I was like, well, I mean, let's say, okay, Mr. Knight, if you came in the Street Fighter room, okay, mm-hmm. and you were like, yo, I'm going to I'm gonna fuck this. Not said that, but, like, if you sat down and you were like, yo, I'm going to take this fool out. And you're like, of course, I would be like, you know, I'd be, and obviously, you know, like, we're friends and whatever, but, of course, like, the whole room is going to be like, yo, why is this? anime player trying to get up on Street Fighter, yo, you know what I'm saying, like, let's, you know, like, whoever it is playing, yo, Joe, beat Lord Knight, whatever, like, that's, like, kind of shit talk that I would expect, but as long as it's not taken to the level where it's, like, I'm sure they weren't being necessarily, like, you know, I I don't really want to use this word, but, like, hurtful, like, it's just, like, basic shit talk, like, obviously, you guys have no problem with any kind of player coming in there to play, am I right or am I wrong? Yo, you're you're really really low. I can't hear you. My bad. Oh my bad. My I have to hold. My <laughs> mic is ghetto. It's just bad. Um, I I tried to watch the archive when he was playing, and I didn't really 
it was nothing that would get me angry, at least. I don't know. Yeah, that's, that's you know, that's what I'm saying. So maybe I was thinking, because I wasn't actually, I finished my pool way earlier than he did. So I wasn't right by um, the stream setup. So maybe there are people behind him saying something mm -hmm. that would, might have gotten him angry. I don't know. I don't know if he plays with headphones or if he doesn't. I don't know. But as far as the commentary, which was what he specifically referenced, it's like nothing. Yeah. I don't know. I think I think it's pretty pretty silly. I mean, it's shit talk. I mean, he played Yipes and he had the entire room who wanted Yipes to win. In all honesty, you know, like I mean, a lot of people do like Chris G, but I feel like a lot of the people in the room when they were playing Marvel, like I feel like everybody wanted Yipes to win. You know what I'm saying? And yeah. he didn't really necessarily complain about that, but he complained about it happening in the anime room, which I'm not really sure what the difference is, you know, but... Like, I'm getting texts from my friend. <clears throat> he was saying, like, he's saying stuff about, um, like, popping off about me and saying how he bodied me in SG, which I played, like, barely. Oh, Skullgirls? Yeah, Skullgirls. Yeah, my friend is... One of my friends are there, and he's, like, saying stuff about me. Whatever. I don't really care. I just play games. That's what I'm saying, dude. Yeah. Let it rock. Let yeah. Let it rock. It's no, it's no big deal for me if... He wants it to, to make it a big deal. There's, we can't even, like, settle it because he'll be like, well, I don't really play a Persona seriously. I don't play Marvel, so then... Yeah. So nothing's going to happen. So I am just, like, drop it. Uh, I, you know, I don't like... I mean, a lot of people think I'm all for, like, bringing up this all this kind of crazy drama and shit like that. That's not necessarily true. You know, I just like to... I like people to know what really happened. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Like, that's why... Like, I'm not trying to make Chris G come on and have, like, this whole crazy argument. No, like, because I know people heard about it, and everyone in the stream was just like, yeah, I heard this, I heard that. But I'm like, no, that's not really what happened. Laura Knight was there. I was there. Let's let everyone know what really, really, you know, like, what happened. Yeah. Just kind of like, you know, not not hearing through the grapevine, but actually hearing from the people who were firsthand in the situation. So, I'm, I'm sure he would say something else. I'm sure his of course. Uh, perspective of is course. different from mine. So, but that's yeah. at least what happened from my perspective yeah. as someone who is at the venue and yeah. stuff. Yeah, exactly. Talk to him. I, I think uh, out of the people who are also, like, there, because a bunch of people who were there also just, like, tweeted stuff at him. Uh, I, I think I was the only one who actually went up to him and talked to him in person. Yeah. Because I don't, I don't want to deal with stuff over Twitter. Because you can say whatever you want over Twitter, you know? Anyone can say what they want over Twitter yeah. or post, like, some funny picture. Yeah, it's stupid. Yeah. I respect it, and I like, I wanted to say that I really like Persona, and I, I actually like all the anime dudes, like, I don't know why people have, like, this certain outlook or, like, problem with them, I've never met one dude from, like, your scene where I was like, who the fuck is this kid, you know, like, they're all, like, you're, they're, they're the same as, as everybody else, I don't know why everything is, like, it's like the fucking 50s, bro, everyone is, I don't know, not segregated, is it segregated, segregated, yeah, segregated, yeah, yeah. yeah, everyone is, like, crazy segregated for absolutely no reason whatsoever, like, like, what, they're fucking people, do they play games, I don't, I don't understand why, I don't get it, whatever, it's not, and the main, the main thing is, you kept trying to bring up, like, this community talk, I play everything, this community talk, I, it's not like you're the only person who plays everything, I play everything too, pretty much, I mean, I do play, like, Street Fighter, I play, like, Vamp I play, like, Poverty, I play, like, Capcom, I play anime, like, I just play everything. Cause I, this is my hobby, this is what I like to do. Yeah, yeah dude, I play, I play everything, too, man. I was in there, I was playing Persona, I played teams, Persona. I, yeah, I saw you in teams, yeah. I was like, what? <laughs> of course, because I, I, I like the game, you know what I'm saying? Like, when Guilty Gear comes out, I'm going to be in there playing Guilty Gear HD. I just, I didn't really, I didn't really like BB so much, that's why I didn't necessarily play it a lot. I remember... That's a love-hate game. Yeah. I, I hate BB, I still play it. <laughs> But, like, we played uh, Melty Blood together a couple times, you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. I, I play whatever I can play, dude, you know what I mean? Like, I'm just, I'm not going to be like, oh, you know, I just, like, the only thing that, like, bothers me is that, how do you, like, go into, like, the anime room and be like, look, you know, like, I'm a popular player trying to help your game. Like, what do you mean? Like, yeah, that's, that, like, that's does, crazy, dude. My, that was now. my problem. And then the other problem was why, why are you trying to move it from, oh, I didn't like what these two specific, specific people were saying about me to oh your community your entire community hates me like why why how is it, how does it move like that yeah how, like where do you get that connection like that's that's what was really bothering me and he wasn't trying to hear anything I was saying of course not but 
And like as far as whatever he thinks of my player skill, like just I just let the games talk for me. Like I did six, like three three zero him multiple times. So in what I don't know in persona. Oh really? Yeah. And so if if that's a problem, then we could just play. But it, I don't want it to be about that. And I know I know underneath it all, he was just angry about like people being mad at him. Mm-hmm. I don't know. I don't know. I, yeah, I don't I don't get it at all. But I guess it's not for me to get. But anyway, um, that's that's what it was. I don't know anything else that happened after that. As far as Twitter stuff, I just totally dropped it. Yeah. In all honesty, I didn't really see any of the Twitter stuff. Uh, I I really wasn't paying attention to it. But, you know, I was there, and I remember hearing about it, and the guy's talking about it. So, once again, that's why I wanted to get you here, to kind of explain what the fuck is going on and why uh, people are being the JJs. There's some people uh, who who went in really, really hard on him Against after him? that. Yeah. You know, that's, that's, kind of, that's something kind of stupid to say. Like, yeah, why you I say was that? like... I was like, you guys need to calm down. The tournament's not over yet. Like, just, just pay attention to the tournament. Don't don't pay attention to this guy right now. Yeah. Like, but whatever. That's that's bad. If he quits for someone over it, well, whatever. Too bad. If he plays and just, I don't know. I don't know. what not that what the headphones are for in the first place? I don't. Well, I was thinking. Yeah, but he just kind of wears them on his head. I don't think he actually wears them. Oh. Like as a fashion statement. No, I, I don't. I don't know. I don't know. I, I don't know. But, you know, like, to, to have, like, Chris is good for, like, every community because he plays everything. You know what I'm saying? Like, and, like, you you can't take away that he's good at, you know, he, he plays very well. You yeah. know, he's he's not he's not bad. Everything he plays, he plays very well. He doesn't necessarily dominate in everything, but he can play anything, and he can play everything well. And, like, a lot of people, I, I don't know why this is, like, the second show when we're talking about Chris G, and I keep clarifying this. I don't not like Chris G at all. Like, every time I see him, we say what's up, we talk for a little bit. We bullshit, like, during matches when we, we watch matches and shit like that. Like, I have absolutely nothing against him, but I guess, you know, like, he kind of rubs some people the wrong way. He doesn't make, I guess, the best decisions, like, it's, obviously. It's like really that. easy to see, for me to see how people could have problems against him, yeah. you know, personal problem against him. I have to talk with him mm-hmm. when he was mad, so. Yeah, well, I don't know. <laughs> Whatever. Whatever. Yeah, I wanted to just clear that up. Yeah, a no, bit no, 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 thank you, because that's what it needs to get, like, you know, sort of cleared up. Cool, cool. Yep. All right, my dude, yo, yes. Persona, good shit. How, how many people at Summer Jam? 120 it was 124. It was a lot of people who, because the signups were really early, because we ended up doing it in one day. So I know of at least 10 or 15 people who wanted to play that were just too late. And I know, uh, what was it? He also had a problem, actually, because Rogue Yoshi was supposed to sign him and Nerd Joss up, but they ended up writing, I don't know who did it, but they put down Rogue Yoshi's name three times in <laughs> pools or something, so they thought they just weren't in the tournament. But they got in the tournament, so it was okay. Well, I wanted to play, but I got there late, so I couldn't come play. Yeah. But I was, yeah, I, I, was I was down for it. I was 100% ready to go, but that's why I played teams, because I couldn't play singles. Yeah, and I was really happy there was a teams tournament. Normally, like Blaze Blue never has teams like, ever. How so, many How many people did you get for teams though? This is like 20, 20 teams. Twenty teams. Holy shit. Yeah, twenty teams. When normally, like, say Blaze Blue will have like a sixty man tournament or something, and then a zero man teams tournament. Yeah. So that's a huge improvement compared to what I'm used to. Well, dude, I I enjoy the game. I think the game's pretty cool. It's fun to watch. It's pretty pretty versatile. You know what I'm saying? There's a lot of different characters. A lot, a lot of the characters play different. There's not so much like very, uh, you know what I'm saying? Like there's not a lot of um, the character diversity to me is very good. 